Comparing this for members of a group at University of South Florida called the Complexity Brown Bag, I'm describing some research that I plan to do, um, asking for their assistance in to, to better understand what the challenges are and the opportunities to apply complex adaptive systems to the solution. There is some software called Arena, which is used to model and simulate the motion of things across a shop floor, such that those elements are being processed usually by multiple machines. Cues are forming in front of machines. Um, there's variability built into the system. And the idea is to design the shop floor in such a way to increase um, productivity and um, look for bottlenecks and so forth. I'm wondering whether this software can be applied to knowledge management. In this instance, the thing moving, the element, is an idea or a fact, an observation, being shared by one person to another to another. And I see some parallels here. Um, you know, we, we, we have a, a limited ability to hold ideas actively in our mind at a time, and therefore um, sometimes we don't perceive something when we when it is communicated to us immediately because we're, our processor is already full at the moment and so forth. Information, however, is different from widgets, so to speak, in that when a widget moves from machine A to machine B, it's no longer at machine A. However, when information is conveyed from one person to another, in a sense, a clone of it is produced and it still exists in, in both persons in their minds. I'm thinking particularly about the National Incident Management System, which FEMA says is the way that teams of first responders should self-organize themselves in the instance of some kind of crisis. And that there should be at least five um, managers responsible for different aspects of the situation. And when one of them observes something, what is he or she to do in terms of knowledge management? I'm proposing that perhaps there needs to be an additional player whose sole responsibility is to keep track of need to know and to help information get to the people, to the person who needs to know it and not simply for everybody to broadcast everything to everyone else, which causes an awful lot of information overload and, and opportunities for misunderstanding and so forth. So if members of the Complexity Brown Bag or others could shed some light on how complex adaptive system theory can be applied to knowledge management, I will, I'll be very receptive and I, I want to know and I need to know what, what you think about this. Thank you.